There's the best view of that little fucker right there. Estoy el corresponsal. Hi, Yona. Grand Theft World. Liberty Radio. What a beautiful day and what an amazing spot this is. Standing just inside West Virginia near the town. Marked on the map as Neal. N-E-A-L. Neal. And across the river we see Catlicksburg, Kentucky once again. Let's see if I can't zoom in to where we can read the Kentucky on that. There. Yeah, you can see it. And there it is, folks. Ashland Refinery. Ashland Oil. And of interesting historical note, Directly behind me here, on the other side of that hill, is where the airplane crashed into the side of the hill, killing the coach and the assistant coach and all of the Marshall football players so many years ago. Gone but not forgotten. Go herd. So here we are in beautiful Catlicksburg, Kentucky, the county seat of Boyd County, although the largest city is Ashland. But this is located at the mouth of the Big Sandy River on the Ohio River. Let's see if I can switch the screen around here on the camera. Come on, man. Oh, don't worry about it. Nice. Nice. Traffic. I like to see traffic in this town because it's kind of dead anymore inside the flood wall here. So I guess I'll have to pause and do this again here. Yeah, yeah, let's just do that. Okay. Off of narrator mode. All right, we got two trains going at the same time. Look at that shit. See that right there? Two trains going at the same time, man. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, look at that. And the bolt's cold, man. There's cold to the right, cold to the left. Cold to the right, cold to the left. Oh, look at all their coal trains, man. Bam! It's amazing. And now to reporter mode. See, si, el corresponsal otra vez. Al muro de inundaciones. Now, if you look down the ramp here, you're going to see the infamous Catlicksburg floating store that so many boatmen up and down the Ohio River depend on here. This is technically the port of Catlicksburg right here. I, I know it doesn't look very impressive, but that's where they pull ashore and make boat landing to get provisions. All right, and let's see real quick here. Let's get this into the flood wall because there's some artistic stuff here. All right, let's see. Try to steady my camera work here. Okay. Blam! And there it is. And so it begins. I should probably zoom in so people can read this. All right. And if you can't read that fast, just put it on pause. Okay. Let's zoom me, make zooms back out here. Let's zoom out to the whole, let, let's get the whole big picture there, Tom Hartman. There we go. To the 1X. History. Isn't 
that cute how they painted that up to look like a long boat? Let's see, Shawnee Native Americans. We're here in Cherokee country and there's no mention of the Cherokee tribe and there's no mention of the Treaty of Sycamore Shoals that was negotiated by Colonel Richard Henderson on behalf of the Transylvania Land Company with the Cherokee Nation. Because, I mean, after all, why are you bargaining for title to the land with the Cherokee Nation, Colonel Richard Henderson, if this is Shawnee land? Hmm. Wouldn't you be making a treaty with the Shawnee instead to get title to the land? Just saying. Ah, the convenient facts that are omitted from this beautiful historical mural. And uh, the funny thing is, you actually cannot even drive all the way down this street because I don't know if I can zoom in enough, but let's see if we can get some of that cone action in the road. There is actually cones blocking the road because the downtown is crumbling before your very eyes, all but abandoned. Ah, yes. Appalachia, folks. Kentucky style. Mmm. The green isn't grass. Uh, I was going to say the green isn't grass on the other side, but uh, the grass isn't greener on the other side. Turns out it's bluer. There you go.